can do a two column in SLS because of the different questions that are already inside my quiz so that we're gonna use the star function to copy over at the, at the different places where the two column exists so the first thing you need to do is to edit and then you can come here click on the three dots and then add a new component of which you have to choose the display to select the two column and then you'll be prompted to select on the left for me i will use the simulation on the left remember simulations are resources so you need to click on the text or media click on it again to invoke the paper clip and then add from star resources so before you can actually edit you need to make sure that it is inside your star resources so to star this resource uh, it took me a while but i eventually figured out that there are little tricks here and there so if there's no star because you need to click done and then the the star will appear only after that so you need to star this resource because this is an interactive media you also need to star this question so this question is start here this this is a little bit tricky because it only appears when it is in the in the done mode lah. oh this this starring part so you need to start this too and then now you go to edit so remember we did the two column display already so come here click on media select the paper clip add from star and it appears to be sorted in a weird manner lah, but i think the trick is you need to figure out the name so having the resource in the appropriate name is important then uh, it will uh, have the various attributes that it used to have okay and you just click save and then you can this is the the tricky part lah, because you're trying to add this question here into this part so rather than ad adding modularly one by one it, it makes sense that sls actually do provide a feature which is over here so rather than selecting any of these three boxes you need to add from existing questions choose from start resources and then it is here now then you choose it then like magic it automatically put everything here from the question the true false and all the feedback and whatever that you have inside this question will all be moved over here so it's basically copied over then you click save and you can see that now the question is now in a two column display of which you took only a few minutes to assemble this together i mean the, the good thing is we are using the star feature in the resource as well in in the question activity details here so this is a very quick uh, way okay so before you uh, end off you need to make sure that this is deleted so before you delete you just make sure that it is the correct question because sls automatically increment the question number so it becomes difficult to identify what is new and what is the old so uh, now this was previously question one and now it's question two so you have to be careful uh, what you're doing